ruling in an ongoing case involving the 2016 wildfires. A judge saying the National Park failed to carry out some of its duties when responding to that fire. What this means is a lawsuit against the U.S. government can continue. You'll remember those awful fires in Sevier County in 2016 left the boundaries of the Great Smoky Mountains National Park. 14 people lost their lives. 2,500 homes and buildings burned to the ground, as well as thousands of acres. Several people have sued the U.S. government and the Park Service, saying it didn't follow its own policies when handling the fire. The government first tried to argue it can't be sued, saying it was immune due to an act that aims to protect decisions that require using personal judgment. But a court disagreed, pointing to the park's fire management plan that outlined certain actions. The U.S. then tried to dismiss the suit again, saying even with the plan, it's still protected due to the same rule. But it has again been denied. The court saying based on evidence, the park failed to carry out all of the mandatory parts of the fire management plan.